Welcome to the VMware ESXi and TPM 2.0 feature demonstration. TPM 2.0 establishes a hardware root of trust and is used to store measurements during ESXi boot. This is done by building upon the secure boot work done in vSphere 6.5. Let's see how it's done. First, we have the ESXi host hardware and the TPM 2.0 device that is on that host hardware. UEFI firmware validates the bootloader against the digital certificate stored in the firmware. The bootloader components then validate the ESXi kernel. These components use the TPM 2.0 API to write measured values or hashes of modules and host settings to the TPM. vCenter validates these measurements against the host event log and VIB metadata and marks the host as attested or not. The init process in the kernel runs the secure boot verifier, validating all VIBs. Every VIB digital signature chains to the VMware digital certificate stored in the secure boot verifier. TPM hashes are always measured at each boot time. The process is a superset of the vSphere 6.5 secure boot feature. Because ESXi secure boot ensures only signed code is run, we can compare the hashes of the kernel boot process in the TPM to the signed hashes in the ESXi VIB metadata later. One of the other measurements used is when ESXi checks to see if secure boot is enabled. After the host boots up and all the information has been sent to vCenter, vCenter assigns an attestation status to the host that is displayed in the vSphere client. This attestation report will show all hosts and their attestation statuses. You can see here that this particular host has failed attestation. This concludes the VMware ESXi and TPM 2.0 feature demonstration. Thank you.